You were right, Max. I couldn't handle it. The conglomerate putting up this thing was just too big for me. I kept thinking that a miracle would happen, and, and somehow I'd be able to hang on. But got my final notice yesterday. My place comes down Friday. I can't do this to you, Dink. We'll fight him, Dink, all the way to the Supreme Court, right? Leo, eat your hot dog. Isn't there anything you can do? Move to another location. My dog is like fine wine. It doesn't travel. Besides, all my friends are here. The little old ladies who buy dogs for their cats. The suit and tie boys who stop by for a quick lunch. The late night couples who know that a Dink's dog is the true food of love. The man is a poet, Leo. Pass the mustard. Hey, hey, wow. No, be careful with my friend here. We've had a pretty good run. Found it right here the day I broke ground, 35 years ago. 35 years? Woo! Maybe it is time to retire. Yeah. Go to Florida and relax. Get some rays. It'd be great. Dink, you're talking to Max. It'd be lousy. <laughs> I hate the sun. I gotta work, Max. I wanna die right here when my dog's on the grill and my bun's in the steamer. Who's in charge of the shopping center? Oh, all the papers come from some lawyer. Guy named Lee Skinner. Now, who's your lawyer? I can't afford one. <laughs> Okay, I'll accept payment in hot dogs. You're a good man, Max. This is my home. I know. What are you gonna do, Mr. Merlin? What I do best. Defend the underdog. Defend the hot dog. <laughs> <laughs>